Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Today I'm going to be doing the latest travel news worldwide part two. So uh, let's jump right into it. Now I've got um, the information from breakingtravelnews.com you can find more information um, about these stories and I've got eight fantastic facts for you so let's fire away um, with the first fact Radisson Individuals launches to independent hoteliers the company has designed its new soft brand to offer independent hotels and local region change the opportunity to be a part of a, a global Radisson platform so that's really good news um, because it'll make some hotels more popular with the Radisson brand and again it could bring more popularity travel wise to that particular region so moving on um to UNWTO calls for global coordination to re to restart tourism the consistent and harmonised travel protocols enhance safety measures and protection uh, of jobs and livelihoods um, are the main ingredients needed for the restart of tourism basically in any country around the world so that's um, again good news um, I hope um, again in time things will get back to normal as soon as possible um, number three Central America virtual European roadshow is to launch this next week wow this is amazing news the new online show will feature over 40 operators from belize guatemala hordonaras nicaragua and will showcase a variety of products for travel i think i'm, I'm going to try and watch that um, in 2021 um, again I think it looks absolutely excellent because you'll get to see um, one two three four countries um, in that region so again um, it's really good news um, and I hope it goes well in 2021 when it's going to launch so uh, number four the WTTC welcomes the move towards airport COVID-19 testing so um, again I think airports around the world should get COVID-19 testing uh, wherever you are in, in the world um, so fingers crossed um it'll go as smoothly as possible number five unfortunately cath air dragon shut down with immediate effect that's the latest airline news now cath air dragon unfortunately is going to close down so and that's an airway that goes to the Pacific um, region, Pacific Ocean, um, 
it's so sad but hopefully they'll be able to um get another pacific ocean airline up as soon as possible and number six it's sandals at resort guests are spending more time in the sun that's really good news and uh, that's uh, again the latest hotel news with sandals and the sandals resorts look absolutely amazing and number seven flyby must adapt to survive in this uh, challenging market should it return in the spring 2021 and um, again it's going to have to adapt um, because unfortunately um, if it doesn't adapt then there'll be other airlines or ways of travel that um, are going to uh, benefit um, so I, again Flybee um, will have to adapt if again it does want to come back um, in spring 2021 um, especially with um, Covid safety messages etc so fingers crossed they'll be back now and finally number eight is Singapore Airlines to return to New York in November 2020 yes and um, this should be absolutely great for Singapore Singapore Airlines and New York so people can get backwards and forwards uh, to America and Singapore so really good news and it's going to happen next month yay and I just think it'll be great for both countries so um, today I'm going to send you a link down below to my October 2020 newsletter it's got um, news about traveling in the UK and also news about uh, traveling abroad so it's free to download uh, don't forget please subscribe it is free and click the notification bell I upload at at least three times a week and um, this week I'm uploading four times a week so thank you for watching if you are going on holiday have a great holiday or traveling and take care and thank you for watching and bye for now and i'll see you in my next travel video which is going to be tomorrow so thank you and bye for now thank you bye